weight division bout. Trained strikers here. Any chance this fight actually goes to the ground? This fight does not go to the ground. This one will be fought in the pocket. Two guys will stand in front of each other. They will trade punches. They will trade kicks. It's going to be a classic matchup that you normally see inside of a ring. You get it in the octagon. Trying to establish that jab once again. I am there to raise the goal and protect his head. He's doing a good job of keeping the guard high, blocking his head, making sure he's not taking those damaging strikes up top. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the judge. Great punch land. Oh, nasty cut right on the bridge of the nose. He is bleeding. And he landed the right hand there. Oh, beautiful jab there from Gaethje, who just might be the most watchable fighter in the UFC. It's so fun to call a Justin Gaethje fight. People think he's reckless, but you think he's a wild man. But Trevor Whitman has him locked in. His technique is beautiful when he strikes. He's got to be careful to his head from throwing his jab. Big power. that nearly closed the show. It was a lot of action. It was back and forth action, but the big moment was that big strike to the head that landed that put him on wobbly legs and in survival mode. Luckily, he made it to the end of that round. Finish 
language from his opponent here DC he's curled up no he's exhausted he's been beaten all right so you have a careful playing on the ground with this guy you don't want to mess around for too long all oh, the ground and pound strikes continue to rain down the opponent better move out of harm's way or the referee's going to stop this he better start to move and when his opponent starts to posture he needs to put his feet on the hip push him away to try to escape this very very dangerous position Two rounds in the books. All right, and they are born, and you hear the collective sigh from the crowd. They're all watching that lift, and we're monitoring it as well. Oh, that kick is good. My gate. Well, not only has he stayed aggressive as he was in the previous round, landing a high volume of strikes, but he's also been efficient, not just with his strikes, but also with his body movement. Complete performance out of this fighter here tonight. Just missed with the left there. Oh, he's landed a high number of total strikes here in the latter stages of this fight. He's really picking up the pace and landing far more strikes than he did in previous rounds. Oh, nice offering there with the knee. He talked to us a lot about that on Thursday. Felt like the knees would be there. It was certainly there on that exchange. He knew they would be available. He just knew he would have to find the right opportunity and right time to land the No good. Oh man, how is he standing? Brutal deep the butt. Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves it, folks. Go finish his fight. Oh, big elbow. Thank you. 
Nice job here blocking these shots. The shin is tough. The hands are high. Pretty good job defensively thus far. Great job defensively. He's seen everything coming. Round DC will show you the replay. He nearly had him out of there. He almost had him out. He had him gone. He hurt him real bad. He thought the fight was over, but the night will go on. Uh, most fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. any damage. Shades of James and Tony always seeing things. Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press it. He's got to take that finish down now. This is a great fight. Oh, big shot land. DC half guard position here. You've done a lot of good work on the ground. It's the end of the round, so it was a huge. Ho, ho, ho. 
Again, the winner here was so aggressive with his 